Hi guys, so today I'm going to be doing my iPod 5 case collection. I know I've done this before, but it kind of got, I didn't have the best camera at the time, so it kind of like my voice overlapped and stuff, and I just am going to delete it, and I didn't think it was good, you couldn't really hear me, it had bad lighting, um, so yeah, I've really been getting into good lighting and like finding places where there is good lighting and like getting really good videos because my earlier videos I know are kind of bad, but I'm going to try to fix the lighting in them. So, like I said, I'm going to be doing my iPod 5 case collection. I have the iPod 5. Here it is. And I just have it in white, if you can see that, and silver on the back. So, sorry, I'm getting an alert. So, the case, the first case, and the case that I currently have on it is my bunny case. I feel like everybody has bunny cases. Um, they are just, you can get them in all different colors. They have ears and a fluffy tail that goes on and off. That was loud. But it's like this um, suction cup, and there's a hole cut out in the case for it, and it's just a fluffy little bunny tail. And the front just looks like this. Um, so, yeah. I really like this case. I think it is adorable. Not the most protective, but it's still more protective than um, one of my other ones. I'm really into protective cases. Like, I don't get unprotective cases. But, yeah, that's the one on right now. And here's my iPod. So, yeah. I'm just going to set that down there. The next case, I'll stick with the silicone ones, is this Minnie Mouse one. I will show you what it looks like on because I know people like seeing what they look like on because they might be different. But it just looks like this on and it has the camera hole right there and it looks like this on the front. It's all black on the ears and stuff but it's still very accessible right there to that button. Um, and yeah, it's really protective. It's really thick and it covers the front. Um, and it has a waffle inside, which waffle insides are really protective. I don't know if you can see that, but waffle insides are really protective, so I really like this case, and I think it's adorable. The next case I have is this panda one. Now, I also feel like everybody has this case. Um, if you agree, like this video. Um, but, yeah, this is what it looks like on. It's just a super adorable panda, and I don't know why I'm having such difficulties getting it on but it just looks like this on the back on um, and then this on the front so it's pretty protective it has waffle inside so I definitely recommend this case and it is also very cute and it's really accessible to all the buttons and it has waffles and if you know me waffles insides make the case waffle insides can either make or break the case like if they don't have them break it have them make it. So, the next one is my pig case. I also feel like a lot of people have this one. Um, but it's just a pig with a little crown and a diaper and it has this little curly tail with a bow on it. And I just think this is super cute. It has some waffles right here and right here and right here, but right here it doesn't have any, which is okay. It's still protective. Um, not as protective as some of my other ones, but it's still does a good job and it's really thin which I like because some of my other ones are really bulky but this one's just thin and kind of light um, but it covers the front a good amount and you can see the little crown and ears from the front and the tail which I think is super cute and the back just looks like this like I showed you so I definitely recommend this case um, I recommend all these cases that I'm gonna show you but I only don't recommend one and I'll tell you what one I don't recommend when we get to it the next silicone one that I have is this Hello Kitty one. And this one's so protective. Like, these waffles are the deepest. Like, I don't know if you can see, but these are so deep, these waffles. And it's just super protective, and it works really well, and it covers the home button, which I like. So, yeah, this is what it looks like on. Sorry. Okay, this is what it looks like on, so it... You, you're getting a lot of coverage on the front, like as you can see the home button's covered, this is all covered on the sides, and on the back it's super cute, it's just Hello Kitty. Um, so this is definitely my bulkier case, and it's just really cute. So I definitely recommend that one as well, and it's really accessible to all the buttons. And then the next one I have is this Winnie the Pooh one. 
there we go. Now, I think this is so cute. It's like a really cute version of Winnie the Pooh, and I love it. It's supposed to stand up, but it doesn't at all. This side weighs it down. It also has waffles, which it made it. Has the ears on that side that you can see, and let me just put it on for y'all. Why did I just say y'all? <laughs> I'm funny. Okay. So this is what it looks like on the front, which is super cute. You can see the little a la little eggs, legs, and the little um, ears, and you can see the curves of its face, which is super cute. And on the back, it looks like this. This isn't too bulky, but it's not super thin, so it's somewhere in the middle. But I just think it's super, super cute and really protective. And yeah, the next one that I have is hmm, I love it. This was like one of the first cases I got. Look at it. It's a panda bear. It is a panda bear. It's a legit, the cutest thing you've ever seen. And it has waffle insides, which is nice. They're not too deep right here, but they're pretty deep here. Um, but this is still really protective. And I'm just going to show you it on like my other ones. If I can get it on. There we go. Okay. So this is what it looks like in the front. Again, you can see the ears and the curves of its face, which is super, super cute. And they kind of have little feet right here. And it is just super cute. This is the back, and it has ears, and it's kind of like 3D, you know, like it, you can feel the parts. Um, but I just think this is a really cute case, really protective, and it's accessible to all the um, buttons. And I get all my cases at, on Amazon. That's the only place I get them. They're super cheap there. Like, I don't spend a lot of money on cases, so like five ten dollars on amazon i get all these maybe 20 sometimes but i normally don't spend too much so now moving on to the kind of harder cases the first one i have which this is the one i do not recommend even though it's super cute it has a blue bow you can pick out whatever color bow you want and it's just kind of sequiny on here it is not protective and super hard so i'm always afraid that this is going to crack crack scratch my ipod um, but as you can see, oops, I caught my sweater in there. It's just not protective. Like, it doesn't cover the front at all. You can see the bow peeking around, and you can just tell that it's not protective at all. So if I dropped it, it wouldn't do anything. It doesn't really cover down here, so if it dropped, it would scratch and crack. And the back looks super cute. Like, I wear it sometimes, but I at home, I never bring it out to wear it. But if I'm taking an Instagram picture or something, I use it. But... I never bring it like out with me or anything because I just am too scared that it's going to drop. And I'm also afraid of taking it on and off because I don't want it to scratch my iPod. Okay, got it off. Then the next one, which I really, really like, is this. It has no waffle inside and it's kind of half silicone, half hard shell. You know, those ones. And it's just black and white polka dot on the back. Simple, but protective, sleek. Like, it slides in your pocket really easily. So if you're going to the beach or, like, somewhere where you need it to slide into your pocket, definitely recommend this. It is just polka dots. And, yeah. And this is the front of it. So it covers the edges. It's not as protective as some of them, but it's still really protective, <laughs> really nice and good and cute. And I just wear this one a lot. Like, I like it. Take my word from it. I just, like, took this off from, off from having it on my, phone, my iPod for, like, three weeks. I've had it on, but I just took it off and switched it. So, then these next two are kind of hard to put together. But they are the silicone ones, and then they have a hard shell on the outside. So it looks like that. I'll try to, like, I won't, like, snap them on because then they take a long time to get off. Not a long time, but you probably just won't want to see me just sitting here putting on and off my cases, you know, as you have to do. But I will kind of just set them on there so you can get an idea of what it looks like. So... As I said, I'm not snapping them or anything, but this is what it looks like. Is this not the cutest case and, like, my most protective? Because it has the silicone in here, so it won't scratch your phone or anything, but then it has the outer hard 
shell, which is super nice. Like I said, I didn't snap them on, but they snap on there and there, and they're super, super protective. Um, you can't wear the shell just by itself because it's too big. It needs a silicone under. But, yeah, I just think this is the most adorable case I've ever, ever seen. But you can wear the silicone one by itself. It's not the prettiest, but you can totally rock it by itself. No, oh, whatever your opinion is. And then I also have that same case, but with a blue silicone underneath. Because I am just in love with these cases, and they're only like $10. One of my more pricey ones, but definitely worth it. Okay, let me just kind of quickly, and it comes with, since I ordered two, I have two outer shells and two inner silicone, so you know I mix it up. Whenever I'm feeling blue, I put on the blue one, you know. Okay, like I said, I'm not snapping them on, but it looks totally different. It looks like more calming and not as bright and summery, so this is good for winter. And yeah, so it's just the same thing, but with a blue silicone. So yeah, love these two. Like I said, rock the silicone just by itself. Like, that's cool. Whatever floats your boat. So the last two things, I call them my iPod pajamas because I made them and they are just this super, they're like soft cloth and this one's just this print and you put I put my iPod in there like when I don't have a case on it which is barely ever like non ever but sometimes I just put it in there like when it's charging or when I'm going on a trip or not using it too much but it just goes in there and it's, it's little like pajamas and it's just a snuggly little thing and sometimes I put it in like I said when it's charging I just put the head down first so then this part's sticking out so that it charges like you know and it's just a pocket. So yeah, I made that one. And then I also made the same one, but in this star print. And I made it on a sewing machine, both of them. And it has a little button right there, and this flaps down buttons. So this one's super cute. Like, just look at this. Like, if you're going on a sleepover, you're just like, yeah, I'm going to dress my iPod up in its pajamas. And they're like, what? And you're just like, yeah, that's how cool I am. So, this is what it looks like. It's super cute with this button and the stars. Um, and then the back is just the same. And then you can see it's in there. Um, so, yeah. That was my iPod case collection. Um, I keep all of my cases in here. I should have showed you this before. But I keep the silicone animal ones up here. Those harder shelled ones right here. And the pajamas right here. So yeah, I got this at Office Max. I just think it's so, so cute. And it's really sleek and nice. And it's a good way to store your iPod cases because I know some people put them in a bin, but this just looks way cuter in your room. And then you can display your cases. So that is all of my iPod 5 case collection. And yeah, leave a comment down below of what your favorite one of my cases was. And also leave a comment um, about any other videos you want me to do. Um, subscribe, like this video, and thanks for watching.